Hey guys, and welcome back to Dead Space. When we last left off, we were exploring and trying to find a way back up to the crew quarters. So, you know, we can actually uh, stick the marker fragments where they need to actually go. Um, let's keep looking. We know we need to get to floor three. And that is to the executive shuttle, which we uh, don't need to get to. Not anymore, anyway. God damn it. I have actually been running... Uh, ah, the deluxe quarters. Um, that. Might. Come on. Right. Executive. Deluxe. I don't think it's the Deluxe we need to go to. Uh, mm, I think it's over this side. Maybe. Chief Steward. Chief Steward's office, eh? Uh, maintenance hall. Inquiry desks. Ah. Matthias. There's Matthias. Very difficult to actually uh, find the right pixel for this game to tell you. There we go. First officer white. Captain B. Matthias. Right, okay. So we need to go to the opposite door. Got ya, big daddy. Let's go. So that, by my guesstimations, should... Okay, he's floating around. Not sure why he's floating around. Right, we actually killed that one pretty bloody quickly. This is the right way, isn't it? This is. This has to be the right way. Let's pop a couple of uh, meds. Alright, yeah, this is the one. I don't know why I had so much trouble finding the way, to be honest. Because I'm... Ah, oh, there we go. Captain Matthias. Wait. That's Lieutenant Commander Holt. Matthias. Oh, uh, whatever. It doesn't matter. Right, this is the one we need. So. We are whole. You will know. You will see. Like we see you. All right. So now that's going to give us access to the uh, hidden ending. Excellent. Which, by the way, I haven't watched. So I don't know what's new about it. What's different about it. I don't know. But I'm looking forward to it. Oh. Are you or are you not dead? Honestly. Okay, so now we just need to go back downstairs and do the thing with the thing. Make sure we get all the thing and we're good to go. Whoop. And I really need to invest in a 4K monitor, but man, those things are still a pretty penny. I would like to get the Corsair one because, you know, I'm a whore for Corsair, but... Jesus. I also like having monitors that match. Um, <laughs> so that's, yeah, not good. But yeah, we're, def we're definitely past 1080p now. However, I don't think I would, in all honesty, be able to upload anything in higher than 1080p. Well, that's not true. I would. It would just take longer. Um, okay. Because I keep getting told the 480 is a, t is a 4K card. I know. 
I'm aware. Now, let's get out of here. Maybe I'll budget all that in when I upgrade my computer. Which will be this year or next year. Let's go. Yeah, man. Open the doors. Now, back on track. Do we need anything from the shop? Uh, Internal hull breaches detected. Get some more flamethrower fuel. When in doubt, get some flamethrower fuel. And sell one of those. The only thing we're really lacking is medical kits, but they're not they're not that important in this game, in my opinion. Hello. Come on. Oh, we got more. There's always more. Excellent. Enjoy your death. Ooh. He must have heard that we needed a medical kit. Maybe he was actually a nice guy and he came to deliver us a medical kit. Okay. We've gone the wrong way again. We've gone the wrong way again. Ow. I mean, honestly, who the hell do you think you are? Seriously. I like going the wrong way, it would seem. Okay. Didn't we get an extra node? Pretty sure we did. And um, we can dump that into... No, we didn't. Oh. Well, I'm stupid, I guess. Alright, whatever. Now, we're back to where we were after putting all those markers where they needed to be. Wonder bar. Engage the cargo crane. I'm guessing we need to do that from this big old island up here. I've completed this game before, damn it, but it's quite a while ago now. Well, that's not good. Misaligned. This is also not great. Come on. You big phantom bastard. Yeah, those ones with dark skin. Woof, they're tough. They are really strong. Uh, that's not good. Cable stress. Chill out, Isaac. We're good. We're good. Ooh, I say. As this guy comes out of nowhere. Damn. Yeah, the quicker you could retrieve it and the quicker we could get out of here. That would be fantastic. Yeah, it's whole. It's definitely whole. Oh. We got hostiles. That flamethrower actually has a deceptively large range. There we go. There we go. Fry. Ooh, and you. Now we're cooking with gas. Big boomy boy coming in the rear. Read into that what you will. Oh, 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 he's gone. We good? Well, this plasma ammo. Plasma ammo ain't no good. Ah. Oh, hi. Hello. Ow. Uh, not great. Oh, really not great. Come on, take your medicine. Access bridge is obstructing transfer. 
There we go. That was uh, bad. Had to come out and give us a bit of slap and tickle right at the end. What we like for flamer fuel. We're good, actually. We're not doing too bad. Uh, okay. Come on. Let's be having ya. Oh, uh, you would have to be one of the big ones. Hold you in place for a minute. Whilst we sit here and think about what's going on. Knew it. Right, let's light you guys up. Oh, this is going to be rough. Come on, keep pushing. How are we doing? I know there's obstructions, but I also know we've got some unfriendlies down here. Purifying them, one flame load at a time. Excellent. You still going? I know we got deep reserves of flame ammo, but come on. Dude. Okay. Now, let's go get our goodies. That was nice. That was a nice little payout, actually. All right. We are definitely losing... Oh, look at the shadows pop in there. That's curious. I'm reading a cargo transfer to the hangar bay. The marker. Good work, Mr. Clark. On our way. Kine, your flight path goes by airlock 19. I can get there from the computer core. The pickup? Yes, we'll be there. Can you make it to the airlock alone? There's no movement on the cameras. I I'm just going to run for it. Wish me luck. Yeah. Good luck, Kendra. Good luck. I'm sure you'll be fine. Okay. Okay, we're good. We're good. Let's get out of it. Before anything worse happens. Saying that, with our flamethrower and plenty of flamethrower fuel, I get the feeling that we could probably hold off the horde all by ourselves. Yeah, I don't like how those shadows pop in. I know it's to save performance, but it's quite jarring. Now, one can of cider left. And this one is peach, mango, and lime. Mm. Don't mind if I do. Cheers. Flaming necromorphs. With a can of cider in hand. Ah. Reminiscent of the old images of the Empire. Anyway, let's go. Flight deck. Now we should be able to get the hell out of here. There's probably a couple of uh, basic locks that we haven't broken into. But. Just run, Kendra. Damn the torpedoes and full speed ahead. Ah, look at this. We remember this place, don't we? We do indeed remember this place. Feels like uh, an old comfortable pair of shoes. Alright. Oh! Yeah, you didn't think it was going to be that easy, did you? Come on. Um, anyone? Thank you. Right, let's hold them back. God damn, this thing makes it too easy. 
Just the one? I'm not buying that. No way. There we go. There's always more. But do you know what? With the old cleansing flame, we're we're okay. Ooh, ooh, you're spoiling us, sir. Damn, they're lining up for us. We're gonna set this whole ship ablaze. We were dead from the start. That's pretty harrowing, to be fair. Okay, what goodies have we got? That was nice. Got a little bit of flame of fuel back from that. Oof, down to, say, two, 250. Left of the flamer. That's not good. Yeah, we're going this way now. Let's go. Your colleague safely on board. My name is Kendra Daniel. Stand by, Isaac. He's bringing the shuttle in now. God, I love the ships. Isaac, we can't run the automated loading control. Must be the damage to the ship. We're losing time. The hive mind is down there. Kind, relax. I'll turn off the gravity in the hangar, then I can load the marker by hand. All right. No, don't worry, Amelia. They understand. <sighs> Jesus. Don't be too hard on the guy, Kendra. Um, after all, you're seeing your brother everywhere. It's not uh, that far-fetched. Alright, well, let's go. Pretty sure we've got to go through here. Let's head upstairs. Is it this one here? Pretty sure, yep. Well, that's the only option that's open to us, actually. All right, gravity control is there. All right, let's go. Uh, deactivate gravity. Now, before we do the obvious, which is go straight to the objective, there's actually quite a lot of stuff to find around here. There's a battery pack, which we will absolutely be needing for later. And wait a minute. Wait, did we come down here earlier? I think we may have done that. But whatever. One thing at a time. And there's that ominous thing. Take you. Some of that. This contact energy is literally like coming out of our ears at this point. Now we might need you out there as well. Uh, might have been a better idea to hold them in here so they don't float away, but we're across that bridge when it comes. Okay, whatever. Now, let's head up and over to the other side because I'm pretty sure there's some goodies over the other side as well. Now, from what I can understand, the peng was actually down here in the original game. Uh, but you couldn't access it straight from the start of the game. So here's the ship that we came in on. Not a lot left of that. Man. Absolutely trashed. I don't know if I showed this off or not, but we can actually come back here and see our friend's body so at least she should be here huh unless she's floated off but our friend's body is usually here, the one that got the broken foot. I forget her name, actually. 
The one people were annoyed at because they gender swapped her into a woman. Um, which, you know, obviously that totally changes the game. Ooh, nice. The game is trash now. Because they uh, gender swapped one of the uh, red coats that instantly dies in the beginning of the game. Now. Wait, did we, we harvested all this stuff. Bastards. This is the trouble when your um, <laughs> videos are literally months apart in some cases. Okay, well, whatever. That's fine. I'm pretty sure in that case I showed her off, didn't I? Her dead floating corpse. Which, you know, parading that around like some kind of trophy seems pretty... Um, Pretty much in bad taste when I when I say it out loud. Anywho, let's go get this thing switched on and ready to move. Okay. Boop. Now we're fully powered. For now, let's see if we can't move the marker. And you know what happens whenever we beep a boop around here. Yep. The game just loves to throw enemies at us. Oh, hello. El hello. Yes. You're a big fella. You're a big dark fella. So you're going to require serious amounts of flamethrower fuel. God damn, you get greedier every time I see you. Alright, cool. So yeah, every time we flick the switch, we're going to get some nasties. Because that's the way this game works. Can we land, please? Thank you. Excellent. Okay. So, cargo rail tracks. Loading shutter. Let's get that moving. All right, we've got a couple of shots there with the canisters. Oh, there's more canisters over there. Can we line those bad boys up? Yep. Wonder bar. Okay. Now this was a little bit. There we go. Of an ass, if I remember correctly. Mainly due to all the enemies that pop up. You would have to be a bouncy boy. Honestly. My god. Who else? Is there a little baby? There you are. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Not much to look at about your skin, are you? There we go. That will work. So, what are we looking at? Uh, ah, there we go. Smooth sailing for now. Get these corpses out of here. Oh, I see it. Oh, ho, ho. hit him right in the head. Happy with that. Good shooting, Tex. Yeah, mum. Light the bastard up. What did you have for me? Credits. A hundred credits. Come on, guys. I mean, this isn't a charity. Come on. 
There we go. What have you got for me, sir? 100 credits. Honestly, guys. Jesus, how cheap do you think I am? Pathetic. Okay. Now, let's go get ready to get the hell out of here. There it is, Kendra. Yep. I'm a hurrying. Oof. There we go. Come on. Okay. And now everything falls to the ground. I'm a coming. Go open the hatch for him. Don't like the sound of your voice there. Ooh. Yeah. What a bitch. Yeah. The marker needs to be destroyed. She can't take the marker. She doesn't understand. Um, so we're fucked. Now, um, oh, hello. Isaac, come in, it's Nicole. Where are you? In the flight control room. Please, you have to come up here now. There's still a way out for us, but we don't have much time. Nicole. Nicole, still alive. Curious. Now, Dr. Klein, he, um, yeah, he met an unfortunate end. I do feel a bit bad for him. And uh, Amelia didn't wait for him in his dying breaths from what he was saying, which is also kind of sad. But that's okay. Nicole's here. And we can see that uh, Kendra. Kendra was using a lot of misdirection on Hammond for the whole game, pretty much. Making. trying to 
at least make us think that he was the bad guy. Now, the actual dialogue in the game um, is way better, I think, than it was in the original. It's way more natural. I thought I saw something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We know, we know, but we're just hoovering up as many goodies as we can. And we're on half an hour. God damn it. Hey, babe. There you are. You good? I got you here. The ship's coming apart. I saw what we've been through. Your investigation, Mercer. What happened with us? We don't have to talk about it. I need you to know I'm sorry about everything. It's okay, Isaac. You know I forgive you. I'm not the only. Well, good, but... There's still hope. You can recall the shuttle and remote pilot from here. Bring back the marker and we can return it to Aegis 7. You can make us whole again. I just want to make things right. And let's do it together. Okay, so we can recall her. That's pretty cool. I like that. Where do you think you're going, Kendra? Escape of fate, but who can? Hmm, who can indeed? Coward ejecting into space. All we were going to do is tie her up a little bit. Reprogram the shuttle with our flight path to Aegis 7 and join you on board. So this is the... Never again. Hmm. You're, uh... You're acting a little bit odd, but okay. Um, yeah, so this... Is the point of no return. That's okay. Nice to have a clear defined point of no return. Let's keep going. I really do like the universe of um, Dead Space. Now I really hope this is going to be the start of a whole new series. I want to see them remake Dead Space 2. And, you know, I'm not... Oh, hello. I'm not even opposed. A hundred freaking credits. A hundred credits and nothing. What? Yeah, I'm not even opposed for them to remake Dead Space 3. Because, um... I didn't hate Dead Space 3. I know a lot of people did. I mean, it wasn't up to the originals, uh, too, sure, but it wasn't an awful game. Anyway, guys, we're going to leave it there, and when we come back, we are going to go down to Aegis 7. So thanks for watching, guys, and as always, till next time.